this message is for the lovely sign of Gemini. Gemini, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. This is a general reading for March 2023, so take what resonates and leave the rest. Maybe some roles are reversed or some situations are reversed, as in coming from another perspective, so just apply it how it applies to your current situation. So, Gemini, what I'm really getting here for you is there is a sense of freedom. There is sort of a dropping of a blindfold here. I feel like you are starting to sort of see things in a new light and maybe you are not entirely liking the things that you are seeing. I'm getting that this is not a time to take risks and more of a time to pull inward and focus on self-love, focus on your financial stability, focus on finding a home within your heart. I'm I'm getting that there is a a sense a sense of stoicism here, sort of not allowing yourself to really feel into your emotions and whatever may be coming up for you at this time. I see it as kind of a a mask. So I feel like you're sort of seeing the light and protecting yourself. And maybe you are seeing, um, again, something that maybe you are not totally comfortable with. And that's okay. Uh, people always say, like, ignorance is bliss. Um, I think that that really allows for some serious heartache in the end. So even though things might be a little bit uncomfortable right now, I think really embracing the unknown is going to be supportive for you. So again, I'm seeing this, this sense of freedom here, this not really needing to live up to other people's expectations. I'm seeing that maybe there was a communication with someone here that has you stuck. Maybe you're thinking about what someone else has said. Um, and it looks like it's, it's time to kind of Maybe spend some time alone, collect your thoughts, figure out what it is that you're feeling and be able to communicate that effectively to this person um, so that you can show up in this situation in the best possible way. I'm also getting a, a sense of needing to understand both sides of something uh, maybe some some compassion is in order here. Uh, maybe being able to come come together with someone else to bridge some gap that may be here, and uh, allowing yourself to really spend some time connecting to spirit and and feeling into how you can best show up in a compassionate way and have your words reflect that. So what you are not seeing for this month is that it really is time to kind of take take a rest here. Um, not expending your energy outwards so much, maybe refraining from uh, social outings just for a little while till you really are able to move through some emotional constipation that you may be experiencing. As far as love goes, what I'm getting here is that Again, with this kind of like blindfold coming down, maybe you've seen something that you haven't wanted to see with a partner or um, someone that you are, you are interested in. And it looks like there's been a lot of hard work that has been put into this 
relationship, whether this is familial or a romantic relationship. It does look like there is some depth here. And it also looks like it's been sort of combative recently. Maybe there has been a lot of disagreements, a lot of arguments, and perhaps this is why this time alone is necessary and to really figure out how you feel instead of showing up in this maybe emotionless way that you have been showing up in. So... As far as work and creative endeavors go, again, slowing down, connecting to your emotional body and being able to process these things is really going to be supportive here for you, Gemini. I am seeing here that uh, your advice from your spirit guides is to really have a little bit more balance in your life and this will this will give you the strength that you need so something that's coming through for me right now is uh having some sort of movement practice so you are able to center and ground yourself uh, after having emotional experiences moving the body can be really supportive maybe that looks like yoga for you maybe that looks like dance maybe that looks like going to the gym or push-ups whatever the case may be for you just being able to find some balance here so that you can regain this strength that you have also uh, again being able to Kind of take things a little bit more slowly, focusing on your financial well-being and I'm actually going to clarify this last card here. Spirit, why is the Ten of Swords in reverse here? Okay, clarified by the Knight of swords. So what I'm getting here is that there has maybe been some sort of uh, cutthroat is the word that is coming through for me right now, cutthroat communication uh, that has maybe left you in this stoic place and feeling a little bit unstable and ungrounded. So um, instead of giving up on this situation again kind of just pulling inward uh gaining some compassion experiencing your emotions and figuring out how you really feel so that you can approach this situation with a little bit more grace so that is what i have for you gemini for march 2023 for gemini sun moon rising and venus thank you